Hey, what's up, everybody? This is our first release for the School's Out Breakout. We got uh, DJ Goldfish right here and my boy DJ Whitebread on my right. Hey, guys. Uh, we're going to be keeping you updated as this uh, event keeps on uh, going on. Just kind of keep you updated, see who's coming out. We've been having a lot of questions about what this event is. and Hella questions. Yeah, hella questions. Um, I think that's actually the reason why we're not selling as many tickets as we need to be is because a lot of people don't exactly know what this event needs to be or what it's going to be. So this is what this video is for so that we can tie up any loose ends and uh, help you guys kind of understand what we're doing here. Alright, so this is what School's Out Breakout is. It's an all-out party. Like, you think you've seen a party like, oh, a phone party at the frickin' club yes. district, okay? <laughs> no. This is nothing like that. This is, we've got rappers coming out, we got bands coming out, all different kinds of bands. We got metal bands, punk bands, we got right. Christian bands, we got rock bands, country bands coming out. We got everything. Not only that, we also got DJs coming out. And in between sets, because we know you guys get bored when bands got to set up and tear down, we got comedians to keep the party hopping, man. This is going to be so far off the charts. It's going to blow your minds. And all of it, five bucks. Five dollars, right here. Five dollars will get you one of these bad boys, get you in the door, get you everything you need to have fun from 5 p.m. to 2 a.m. and more. And more. Actually, doors are going to be at 4 p.m., so be sure to show up early. Show up early so that we friends. don't run out of room. Bring your friends. And make sure you can get a place to park. Yeah. Uh, parking will not be held at the reefer. Actually, Ooh. it'll be held across the street. Across the street. But we'll, we'll keep that info for later. We want to keep this kind of short and sweet. So, um... Basically, just to give you guys an idea of what kind of stuff we have coming out right now, I'm just going to narrow this down really quick for you guys. We got I Shot JR, Awaiting Confirmation. Pretty sure they're going to be there, though. Definitely. Rise and Fire, just talked to their manager today. They're pretty much a shoe-in. All you got to do is clear it with everybody, make sure their work schedules are to key. Same with Two Minutes Hate. Two Minutes Hate's the same pr thing. All the band members are cool with it, managers are cool with it, they just gotta see if they're singer and get off work, so they're basically in too. Also, if my band's ready, only memories remain, we're gonna be out there to entertain you guys as well. Okay, moving on to comedians. Today we have been having our phone blowing up with comedians today. Dude, my phone was ringing off the hook. I like, couldn't I even put talk, it down. I couldn't even then... talk to this guy. It was ringing so much. It was crazy. We, I had like two, three phone calls coming in at the same time. We were we talked to maybe about ten to twenty comedians today, and we narrowed it down to four. Bizarre. Uh, <laughs> first one, we got Crowns. They're an improv crowd participation group comedian thing. They're going to be a lot of fun. Secondly, Tangela Eckhoff, awesome lady, funny as hell. We talked to her on the phone just, today. She had his freaking rolling, man. Right. Like, just random crap. She's like, what is this, thug life in Owasso? This <laughs> crazy crap. It's not even part of her stand-up. She's just making us laugh. It was awesome. Uh, she's a pretty cool girl. Also, the last guy we heard from today was Dustin Morby. He's a stand-up comedian, also does some crowd participation. He's coming all the way from Kansas. That's like a four-hour drive. To do this event. He even cut down his price a little bit just so that he could be there. Last this is for you guys. Last comedian we got. My good friend that I used to work with, Rudy Ramon. He's done a lot of stand-up at the Looney Bin and other places like that. He's got a lot of experience. He'll keep you rolling a little bit on the edgy side, but you guys are going to have a lot of fun with that. Moving on to DJs. Right now, the only two DJs and probably the only two that's going to be there is me and my friend here. We're going to keep it rolling. We're going to have a DJ power hour outside the refurb. So all you guys worrying it's about be being ridiculous. crammed. All you guys worrying about being crammed up in a hot place. It starting summer and everything. Do not worry. It's going to be outside. Don't worry. You're about going it. to have refreshments. From the bar inside, we got drinks, we got cokes, we got pop, we got alcohol, 
anything you want to make the night a good one. Alcohol is for those of you 21 and up, just of for course. the record. <laughs> None of that. Hey, I'm 18, let me get a beer. No. No. Mm-hmm. Sorry, guys. It's the law. <laughs> it is. No. So basically, we're going to be playing all of uh, the good stuff you guys like to listen on the radio and dance to. Have Bring a chick, have some fun. Also, we're going to have some rappers, believe it or not. Right now, we only got one, but he's legit. I mean, so I'm, not gonna, I'm not even going to lie about that. This guy, he, he's personally a good friend of mine. Yeah. I've he is also him. He's also our graphics designer who's doing our posters, which will be out Friday for any of you guys who are wondering about that. But his name is Daniel Reese, a.k.a. Slick. He's going to be a lot of fun. Um, also, a little bit more information you guys need to know is we're going to have some T-shirts. School's Out Breakout T-shirts. The staff's going to be wearing them. But we're going to order a certain amount, so you need to pre-order now so that we need to know how many we need to get and everything. But we're definitely going to have some there. We're going to be handing out some for free, everything. Some of you may have to pre-order them there, though. Just warning. Just in case we run out. Just in case we run out. We're going to have an order form there so you can get them in case you want your shirts. Because we know after you guys leave this event, all your friends that were talking trash, you want to walk past them in their shirt and be like, Dude, you totally should have been there! Yeah, we know that feeling. Also, we want you guys to know that if we make this as big as we want to, we're actually going to make this an annual event. So, no one-time thing. Tell your friends that are juniors right now, hey, you need to come up and do this next year. It was a lot of fun. So um, Definitely. For the record, this is all ages, but we don't want anybody bringing in their, like, five-year-old little daughter or cousin, it, it, brother, even sister. Though, even though it is all ages, it's still kind of a club atmosphere it's still a concert atmosphere right it's designed for, it's for high the... school kids and college age kids because that's what we are we know that's what you are and that's what you want that's why we're bringing it to you guys like that so just leaving that out there for you guys right um also um is there anything else we need to tell them at this time tickets you can get your tickets on the website website is schoolsoutbreakout.webs.com you can go on there and pre-order your tickets you can even use paypal if you want right five bucks that's it five dollars gets you a ticket and gets you in the door everything else it's up to you guys we're just providing everything we're just providing everything basically five everything. bucks gets you in the door all you gotta pay for is it's refreshments it's a really good deal it's a great deal if you guys go to the club they charge off the wall for stuff, and you're paying ten bucks to get in. We're charging five. Come on, this party is going to be ridiculous, and it's just to help you guys ring in the summer. Cause we know you guys worked hard all year. We've been there, done that, and it sucks. So come out, let your hair down, party with us. So I think that about wraps up our first uh, video here. Um, any new information we get, we'll definitely let you guys know, keep you up to date. Definitely. Um, We're going to post a new video every week on a Friday. That way you guys can keep updated every week so that you know when Friday, June 3rd comes up, that's when School's Out Breakout's happening and you know everything that's going down. Except for this video, of course. This video is not on a Friday. It's recorded on a Thursday. Whatever. True. But, yeah. So... We're going to let you guys go. Think about it. Get your stuff in check. You got a month and a half, a little bit less than a month and a half to decide what to do. And I think this is enough time in advance for you guys to do that. So be there. We'll see you there. Deuces.